Hi, I'm Underbelly, and you suck at producing. In last week's lesson, we learned about the Ionian or major scale. But it's one thing to understand the scale intellectually. How do we understand it intuitively so that it simply flows out of our fingers, like the urine that flows out of Uncle Joe every time he drinks a new bottle of whiskey? That's why learning the piano is so important. It allows us to internalize these abstract theory concepts and apply them to our own music in a creative, fun way. But no one wants to spend years toiling away in their Uncle Joe's basement learning batch or beat oven just to play it to an old man and his idiot child. That's why in today's lesson, we're going to learn how to play piano using an app called Melodics. Let's get started. Okay, so check it. Melodics is a desktop app that allows modern producers like ourselves learn keys, pads, and electronic drums all on our computer device. Wowzers. You'll notice that when I open up this home screen here, we have a view of the last course or lesson I just took, as well as detailed stats as to how much I practiced this week and these fun little stars over here. Like my old Russian piano teacher, Melodics is big on practice, but instead of beating my head over with the stick, Melodics actually rewards us for practicing by giving us these fun little gold stars that let us level up and detail our progress over time. Let's go over to our learning tab and pick a course here. You'll notice that there's literally hundreds of courses at our disposal and lessons that go into specific songs and techniques from all kinds of genres. Let's go ahead and start with something basic here over on our courses tab. Courses are a series of lessons that go into a specific concept or technique here. Let's start pretty basic here. Since we went over the Ionian scale last week, let's go ahead and do an exercise there to practice it. You'll notice that we have a detailed view of the keyboard here with all the notes labeled as well as the musical staff and it shows us the correct fingering for each note here. Oh wowzers. Okay, I'm really doing it. So it's pinky, ring, middle, index. Okay, I seem to getting it. Okay, but I want a sick beat over this. Jesus Christ. Oh shit. What the fuck? This is like the sickest trap banger ever. Okay, looks like I only have three reps to go. Oh boy, I'm getting really excited here. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Fuck. Okay, I'm ready to move on here. Let's go ahead and put this into a song here. I'm going to move on to the next lesson. And here we'll actually start to apply this in a musical context. So it looks like it'll give us a preview of we need what we need to play. And give us a nice little tip over here. Looks like we have to hold down some of these notes. Okay, wowzers. All right. Okay. All right, so let's go ahead and, and try to give this our, a shot ourselves, okay? All right, okay, um, okay. Uh, I'm really nervous here. I don't know if I can do this, but let's give it a shot here. You'll notice now we're actually getting into the performance side of things where it's kind of like guitar here. We have to go ahead and play each of these notes that are coming down here at the correct time and actually sustain them for as long as we need to as well. So cross our fingers here. Let's see if I can actually do this. Oh boy, all right. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, I got a streak here. Oh boy. Oh, okay. Oh, I was a little late there, but that's okay. Mladex, you have my side. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I was a little early there. Let's try it again. Okay, I'm getting nervous here. Oh boy. Oh, wowzers, I actually did quite good there. You can actually see my progress tracked here over time. 
Let's go ahead and move on to the course here. And let's see if we can actually go to something a little bit more challenging. So I'm going to exit out of this course here and actually go to a specific lesson that I played recently. And you'll notice that we have a bunch of lessons from a bunch of famous producers. Looks my boy Diplo over here. What a sweet man. But I'm actually going to go ahead and move over to this lesson. I'm, I want to play some sick chords here. Since I already played this, let's go ahead and stop this right here. I'm going to go to the beginning of the lesson. So if we can start from the beginning here. Melodics is actually really good at breaking down each of the individual steps of a lesson. So it's never too overwhelming. Let's start with this chord progression here. Okay. So it looks like this is what we need to play. Okay. And notice here that Melodics actually labels each chord. It tells us what chord we're playing here. C major 7 second inversion. So it's actually useful from a theoretical perspective as well. So let's try moving on to the next chord here. Notice that I'm using the thumb, index, ring, and pinky here. Okay, wowzers. Oh boy. All right, so okay, let's see if we can actually do this here. All right, let's give it a go. Okay, oh shit. Oh, fuck! Okay, I'm really starting to panic here. Okay, that's just... Oh, that's just too much for me. So, if a performance is ever too much, you can always go to the practice mode over on the upper right here and actually take things nice and slow. So, we can actually lower the BPM here. Start a little bit more gentle. Okay, wowzers. Here we go. Oh, shit! Oh! took a bunch of coding or something. Now here's a really cool thing. If this is ever too much, we actually turn weight mode on so that the course won't move on until I play this chord correctly. Wowzers. So it's actually even more gentle if we're really starting to wrap our head around these chords. And now that I've practiced this a little bit, let's go ahead and go back to the performance mode and see if we can get this going. Oh boy. Oh shit! Okay, I'm really starting to be a house god here. Oh wowzers, we did... I Guess okay, but let's let's just move on. Okay, we'll come back to that if we want to really make it going. Now let's go ahead and move on to the full chord progression here. Melodics, once again, really good at breaking down each step. Oh, new chord here, G diminished. And once again, I really like how it's actually labeling what the chords are, so we at least have some understanding from the theory perspective here. Okay, let's try to see if we can get this. Oh shit! Derek's gonna be really oh fuck I fucked that one up. Okay, Derek's gonna be really impressed with me here. Okay, I'm not satisfied there. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna do that again. Okay, here we go. Oh boy. Oh gosh. Oh yeah, you fuck. You take that melodic. Oh boy, I'm starting to cream myself and really make proud of myself. I did so much better that time. Okay, let's keep going here. On to the next step. Let's do some basic syncopation here. Once again, we're probably going to have to listen here, so let's listen to the step real quick. Oh shit! Now we're starting to actually play the chords a little early. Okay, so let's try that. Same chord progression. It's all about the timing here. Okay, so let's try that again, one more time. Here we go. It's like guitar here on steroids. Wowzers. It actually keeps track of how many notes I hit perfectly. 
what my streaks were, if I was a little late or early. It's very, very regimented, very clean with how the stats are presented so you can really see how much progress you're making here. And there's literally hundreds of these lessons that you can go through from theory, from chords, arpeggios, and whatever kind of genre you're interested in, Melodics has your back. Wowzers. Okay, so check it. You can download and start playing with Melodics for free just by clicking on the link in the video description below. I'm Underbelly. Have a great day.